Hey everyone, how are you today? Lucia here from Laughing With an Accent. Hope you're doing amazing. I am super hot right now, you guys. <laughs> I wanted to film, it's about 3.30 and I have a live right after like a five, as you know, you may know. But I didn't want to film after because then everyone's home and dinners are getting made and all that. So I was like, let's just do some now, but it is hot. So don't mind if I melt and I wanted to turn on the fan, but I was like, it's going to be too noisy. So let's just try to do everything i'll try to do some breaks to um wipe my face today i have a stitch fix unboxing and this is the one for my second account um stitch fix if you don't know is a clothing subscription box where you pay 20 dollars of styling fee they send you five items to try in your hat in your home and then you send back what you don't want the 20 dollars gets applied to an item that you keep and uh there is some people that get offered a style pass which is sorry something it's just here um you pay 49 dollars a year those 49 dollars get applied to something you keep and then you don't have to pay any more 20 dollars styling fee with this account i don't have a style pass so i do pay 20 dollars styling fee but sometimes i find that the items that they send uh i like more than the items from my other account so i don't know let's see if i can show you the bundle because i did peek a little bit so it's coming apart but when i saw the preview oh uh they rolled in this new feature where you can preview items and they show you 10 items and you choose five or less if you choose less they will fill it up with other items uh not necessarily from the ones that you rejected okay so i chose a couple and then i think they filled it up with other items when i saw what they sent i was like oh i'm in trouble because i like everything so let's start from the beginning uh, we have here the mail there where you send back everything that you don't keep then we have here an envelope where we get a letter from our stylist for, plus some styling tips they basically put together ways to wear what you received uh and ideas and stuff like that and i have emily which i think it was the um stylist last time as well so let's read this is this was my mom's account so it says hi elizabeth it looks like the summer heat has made its way to california i'm glad that you loved a couple of the pieces from the from your fixed preview the teal green dress from fortune and ivy will make such an effortlessly stylish addition to your summer wardrobe let me know how you like its length I saw your feedback that you'd love some casual t-shirts and maybe active wear. Cannot wait for you to try the pieces that I've chosen for you. I came across the, this, da, da, da. let me know if you like some sneakers or biker shorts in your next fix. I am looking forward to your feedback on this fix and any other details that you'd like to share. Best, Emily. Okay, so let's just start. I think this was an item that I chose from my preview and it's a 41 Hawthorne blouse. And this is polyester and it is really beautiful it's like a sagey green uh, it looks a little more light in the video but it has this little sleeves um kind of like a roughed how do you call it you know like pleated in here and then on the back there's a keyhole super pretty i don't know if this will make me kind of hot and we'll see how it fits but it does look really cute and it's a very unique pattern like this black and green it's very pretty so that is one item that i loved then we have this and this is a casual t-shirt i think it's a daisy button back detailed knit top by pink clover and they call this brown for me it's more like um i guess it's like a peachy mauve i don't know how to call it but and here's a detail in the back this is a knit top so the fabric is a little thicker let me show you the inside it looks like Kind of like a sweater but lighter like not sweater sweatshirt but lighter but it's cute i just don't know if i'm gonna get hot again i'm trying to like wear items that i can wear around the house where i don't have ac so i can be comfortable uh like even this top i was wearing it today and i had to take it off for a little bit because it's also polyester and it makes me like you know hot then we have this one this one's another knit top i didn't know the fabric when i saw the preview so i like the colors it's kind of like a heather purple so it's very light in there and this is light blue they call it for me it's more like a purple maybe periwinkle yeah don't you feel like it has some purple or maybe i'm colorblind mark and spruce juna high low knit top now i don't know if this is active because i don't think i would work out in this i do love the high low but again it's knit so it feels like it's a very light sweatshirt material am i saying it wrong right or wrong i don't know 
it's not like a regular casual t-shirt you know what i'm saying like it's more heavier and thicker but it looks nice then we have the dress and this one oh my gosh when i saw it in the preview i was like in love i love these colors now when i picked it up it feels very heavy because it is double lined completely so it has line uh, okay guys so uh my phone ran out of battery so i don't know if i'm gonna have to refilm the whole intro sometimes the video appears by itself so we'll see but i'm gonna keep going um from where i was with my phone ran out of battery so i'm gonna have some iced tea i made some iced tea while the phone was charging so good okay so what i was saying is that this dress looks beautiful but it is all fully lined so it might be a little hot uh, but we'll see i think the outside is polyester it has some buttons in there and it has kind of like a i don't know how to call this kind of waist but it is below the bust i think it's going to be like there's an empire with with that waist got it but we'll try this on and it looks very pretty i love the color and sorry if i didn't say this is fortune and ivy jana button detail knit dress and teal green and last but not least they sent me some leggings these are ribbed leggings they do look kind of small so i don't know if they stretch they are extra large and they're the all, all phoenix anita ribbed core 7 8 performance legging in gray this again looks like a more of like a sagey green not sagey but something else gray but with some green um and yeah so we'll try it i don't know if this will fit but i do like it now let's go over the pricing first we'll do this okay so the total for this fix is 238 with the 25 percent discount if you keep all the items it is 59.50 so the total would be 178.50 minus credit that i had 24 dollars minus the styling fee that also was credit so i had 48 total the total is 134.14 which is not that much for a fix obviously if you go outside in the real world it might be a lot for 138 dollars you might 34 you might get a ton of clothes but in the stitch fix world that's not that bad okay so the ribbed leggings uh, are 68 dollars um which is a little high then we have the pink clover which one was the pink clover this one is 34 dollars so very reasonable for stitch fix um i don't love to keep vertical uh stripes usually but i do like this color now it is a little bit feels thick so i don't know but at the same time it feels breathable so maybe it's not that hot let me see what material this is polyester rayon and spandex so rayon is, I don't know, like a softer material than spandex is. So maybe that's, you know, a good combination. The 34, it's not bad. Then the Fortune and Ivy dress is $54. Then the 41 Hawthorne top is 38. And this one, here's this light purple. Uh, it's 44. So we have to try everything, see how I feel, you know, and then this side, I do have $40 in credit, so I could or like keep one of the items are around that price. So let's do the try on and then decide uh, outside when it is windy, hopefully. So excuse the wind chime, sometimes they go a little crazy. But I try to film when it's not too sunny for the, you know, the sun to get in my face. And also when it's a little windy, so I can tolerate changing clothes so much. Okay, let's go okay. and try So first top is this one. When I showed it in my life, everyone loved it. And it's like such a beautiful, I feel like it's just a beautiful top. And even like gives me like a waist. And the kids are playing. How gorgeous is this? I love the sleeves. I love the black. Uh, the flowers i know maybe some people might say like kind of makes you look like an old lady but i don't think so i think it looks really beautiful tucked in or not tucked in looks beautiful what do you guys think you can even wear like a i don't do this because i don't like how it does to my hips but a pleated black skirt or something like that i think it would look gorgeous like that Something like that oh my gosh this is too pretty i was afraid that this kind of polyester will make me hot 
but I don't know. And it doesn't feel like tight or anything. This is beautiful. Mm. Let me see. Let me show you the back. It has a little keyhole. I don't know if you can see it. Very pretty. So I don't know. Today is like a humid, windy day. So I don't know if it's like a good, you know. But this is really pretty. I feel like you can wear this at night too for a party. You can like, you know, black jeans or black like mini skirt tuck it in like really something shiny i don't know what you guys think i think it's beautiful what do you agree or not oh this thing let's go try on the next okay so we have this one very pretty I my, my rolls in there. Sometimes I put my bra super tight and I don't realize. So then I make extra rolls, but it has the buttons in the back. And it feels like even though this is knit and I was afraid, like maybe this this is why they're popular because it feels like it's breathable. Maybe that's what the material. I don't know. Like it just doesn't feel like it will make me sweat. You know? What do you guys think? The color is not great, especially now that I'm tan. I almost feel like it's very nude, so I don't know what this. But it feels really nice. It feels soft and something that, you know, to wear at different occasions. So, but it is pretty simple, if not for the detail in the back. So, what do you guys think? I have the phone. I guess I put the phone the other way now. Like, I'm used to like the lens being here, and I'm like, it's there. It have paint from crafts from before. So, <laughs> let's try the next one okay so we have the purple one and this is cute i like this color a lot more than the nude and it's like a different kind of knit but it's also knit it's not as soft in the outside it's a heather purple and it's cute oh we like that it's pretty long too so this will be nice. I think it's a good top for like summer and the beginning of fall. We don't have that much cold here. So our fall is like seriously like an illusion in Southern California. <laughs> like all my sweaters and stuff like that, I barely ever get to wear them. So this will be a nice top to keep wearing in the fall if it's not super hot. So, you know. Um, but yeah, I don't think you work out in this knit top. I think it might be too thick for working out, but it's cute to wear, you know, out and about in the house. What do you guys think? Does the heather make you look a little pajama-y? Let me know. And then I have the dress and the leggings. The leggings, I might actually try them on another time when it's less humid because I feel like they're small and I'm going to struggle putting them up. So, yeah. Um, let's go try on the dress, which I'm very excited to see how it looks. Okay, so I haven't looked at myself yet, but <laughs> let's start with... The top is beautiful. I feel like this is kind of low, one of those things, but I did buy something to put on stuff like that, like a little bundle. It's black, maybe you should buy a white one. Love the cap sleeves, love the color. So let me go, let me put my, let me go back so I see how it looks. Okay. I feel that it's a tad short. Um, I don't know, no, maybe not, but it felt at first that it was kind of short and I'm like, I feel like I'm pulling it down. So, what do you guys think? Does it look good? Does the waist fall in a good place? It's something that someone had commented in my post that it was weird, they loved it. But I think it's really beautiful. What do you guys think? I have to watch myself again because I can't see myself. This color is so beautiful. Love it. What do you guys think? Let me know. Super pretty. Is it length good? Here, I feel like if so, I don't know. Yeah, I think so, right? Okay. Okay, let's do a recap now. I love the first top. That one might be a keeper. This might be a keeper too. The leggings, we don't know yet. Um, they're kind of light and I feel like you can, 
I saw someone at the gym the other day with a similar color and you can see when the sweat was coming through the pad, you know? So if that color is very light, like I don't want people to see my sweat, you know what I'm saying? But it also looked a little smallish. So I don't even know if it's gonna fit my hips. That's one thing. So the, the um, those are definitely like maybe, maybe not. The two other tops, the knit tops, they're great, but I'm not super convinced or super in love. However, this fix was really inexpensive. It's a hundred and something, and it would be cheaper to keep everything. And then I can see if I can sell those items in the Facebook groups, which sometimes I've had good luck doing. So to get the discount. So we will see. But the dress and the first top, beautiful. I love the pattern. I love the, you know, the way it looks, fits. Let me know about the dress. What do you guys think? Um as I lose weight, you know, like you will go down a little bit, <laughs> look better. I think this is a great dress for summer and again, even fall because I'm telling you some colors still go to fall. You can wear a cute cardigan. They had a Target, like some cardigans, this teal color. I didn't get any because I had enough cardigans, but they do have like, you know, have a yellow one. Ooh, that'd be great. Like you can put boots, yellow, like a yellow cardigan, ready to go. If I can wear anything warm because I normally can't. So anyway, that was everything for this fix. Let me know what you guys think and what do you think I should keep. Thank you so much for joining me on another video. Please give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you on my next one.